U.S. officials say Israel hit Iran with a missile in the early hours of Friday, in what appears to have been a retaliatory strike after weeks of escalating tensions between the two countries. There are competing claims about the scale of the attack on the Isfahan region and the extent of any damage, with Iranian state media downplaying its significance. It comes after weeks of soaring tensions between the regional rivals, which have already seen an Israeli attack on an Iranian compound in Syria, and Iran launch an unprecedented assault against Israel. Here is everything we know about the latest incident so far. Israel does not routinely confirm its military actions, which have targeted Iranian-backed armed groups in Syria and Iraq on many occasions. However, U.S. officials have confirmed to the BBC's partner CBS News that an Israeli missile did hit Iran. U.S. sources say a missile was involved in the attack, while Iran says it involved small drones. Iran's government tightly controls access to the country. The BBC does not have direct access to the central region of Isfahan, where this incident played out overnight. So far, there has been a lot of speculation regarding the type of missile used. News 54 Verify has tried to identify the weapon by analyzing images of wreckage posted from an area in neighboring Iraq, 60 kilometers southwest of the capital Baghdad. Among experts, there now seems to be a wider consensus in thinking that a two-stage missile was used, and was probably air-launched. Many identify the debris with Israeli-produced Blue Sparrow missile.